So look, I am literally in my kitchen, guys. So I'm officially starting to vlog. I'm very uncomfortable, but fear is a thing that we gonna get over in 2021. I am not comfortable with holding this vlogging camera so close to my face. You guys are gonna see all the crooks and the crevices and the lumps and the bumps, but I'm gonna get used to it, so that's reality right so anyway i'm standing in my kitchen i've been doing a lot of home uh decor a lot of redecorating and um i decided to bring you guys along so one of my first projects was my half bathroom some of my instagram girls they saw the journey it took me a very very long time i really wasn't in a rush um i try not to rush rush any of my projects because i really 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 want to get pieces that reflect me my style my home my family so i try to take my time you know i take some inspiration from um uh interior decorators i take some inspiration from things that i see on instagram and pinterest but for the most part i try to make sure all of the projects that i work on um reflects me my energy my style so with that said i'm going to go ahead and reveal to you guys my bathroom my half bathroom is completely finished um also, um, I'll insert some clips so you can see us working on a few things um, in that bathroom. But in the meantime, I'll be back. Give me a minute. Hey guys, so during my editing session, I decided to add a few clips of hubby preparing the bathroom for our um, bathroom updates. So enjoy. This is the door to my bathroom. Okay, so stepping in, the first thing you see is this wall. Okay, so we're gonna come in the bathroom and then I'm gonna talk to you guys about what's in the bathroom. Hey, y'all. Hey y'all, hey. Okay, so if you're sitting, let me see it on the toilet seat. So if I sit on the toilet seat, this is my view. So the light fixtures you won't be able to see pretty good, but okay, so let me get close. Okay, so starting with my sink, I got this goodie from Target. Purchased the towels from Target. Um, this little soap dispenser I got from Home Goods. Um, this bathroom spray got from Target. This plant I got from Target. And this mirror I got from Home Goods. And I don't know if you can see it. You have to get closer. I got this light fixture from Wayfair, and it's really, really cool, guys. Um, the camera is not capturing it to the full potential, but you get the track. Okay, let's bring this back down. Okay, here is a towel holder. It's like a glam towel holder, and this hand towel I'm obsessed with. It's from Masoni, which is a luxury designer brand, and they actually sell um, home decor as well. So it just fell right into the vibes of the bathroom. And this is the rug. Um, I got this rug from Bed Bath & Beyond. So, if I step back, 
the wall art is so cool guys so i wanted the wall art to reflect um a, a variation of things right um i love roses hence kara java rose um and i'm into line art so i thought this piece of art was gorgeous and just the features right so the slanted almond eyes the lips very full like i just fell in love with this piece of art when i seen it and it's from society six and the frame all the frames are from target and then um i found this piece and this piece is gorgeous as well again i fell in love with the art um, the flowers. I love flowers. I really love roses. Um, it's a reflection of me, um, right? We have the features. We have uh, what is excellent, right? Ebony, um, lashes, nose, lips, just our features. So this piece of art speaks volumes. I love how the background has that mauvey look to it. I'm really into reds and mauves and browns and stuff like that. So I thought I had to add this piece to the collection. I got this from Society6 as well. Actually, all the art here on this wall is from Society6. And this pretty lady reminded me of myself when I was a little younger. So I went ahead and decided to, I decided to go ahead and purchase her. Only because, again, she reminded me of myself, like the younger version of me. Um, you know, I don't have a ring in my nose, but um, that's the um, beauty of it. Like, she's not exactly me, more, more of a character of me. Um, but yeah, I love this piece. I love the, the background is like orange, um, but this is perfect. So again, the frame is from um, Target. And then moving down. This baby, I'm in love with this piece of art as well. I'm not sure if you can tell, but her hair is like, it, it blends in with the galaxy. And then the red lip is my signature, I fell in love. And again, this just represents like me, right? It, it represents me as a woman. Um, the art I was really, really, really um, picky with. I didn't wanna just get anything. So um, I think this is a good depiction of Kira style, you know, who I am and stuff like that. So yeah, and then I'm gonna step back. This is where everybody handles their business. But in the meantime, look at this artwork, guys. Like, Jesus. Anyway, this piece of art I purchased from Minted, and I first seen this piece of art in a um, what's her name? Hyatt. Hyatt's. She's an Instagram um, blogger. I saw this in Hyatt's house, and I fell in love. She did a tour of her home, and I just kept thinking about this piece of art, and I said. Did she even mention where she got it from? And I don't think in that particular um, house tour, she mentioned it. So I just kept thinking about it, but I didn't know where it was from. I didn't even know where to begin. One day I watched her live and she told where she got it from and it's from Minted. And guys, I'm totally in love with this piece of art. Like it takes me back to like salt and pepper days, right? Look at the, listen, this is self-explanatory. You could just see this for yourself, take it all in. But, oh God, I love it. So anyway, we're gonna get up the art. Oh, the, the, um, the frame is from Amazon. The art is from Minted and yeah. So I decided to put some pompous in the bathroom, give the bathroom a little bit of character. So I picked up this vase, this floor vase from at home. And this pompous, I'm gonna get close. It's a mixture of faux pompous, this is faux, and then this is the real pompous. So I purchased this faux pompous from CB2. 
Um, and unbeknownst to me, my husband works in an area where pompous just grows like you wouldn't believe. So one day he called me and he's like, babe, is this the stuff you be buying from all the different stores? I say, yes. So he brought me a ton home. So thank God I no longer have to purchase pompous or full pompous. So yes, but I decided since he, he brought so much home, I'm like, let me put some in the bathroom. So yeah, guys, this is the corner of the bathroom where the toilet is. This is one of my favorite fragrances, uh, candles, sorry, not fragrances, from, um, is it, what's the name of it? Bed Bath & Body Works, right? Pomegranate Lemonade. This smells so good, guys. Like, if you want a fresh scent in the bathroom or the kitchen, check it out and then the purple it just went along with the decor so i decided to leave it back here on the toilet i'm not sure if i want to put a tray back here or put something back here um i do have a basket that i leave under the counter with um under the um the sink with uh stuff for people to use when they come in like i have pads and wipes and stuff like that so i'm thinking about putting something back here but i'm not sure because I don't want to clutter up this area. And then, let's see if I can get down here. I got this little um, basket from Home Goods, and it's so cool. It has this little diamond shaped um, design on it, and it's like a gold, but like a brassy gold, and it just flowed with the bathroom. So, guys, this is a labor of love. This bathroom is literally a half bathroom and it took me months to complete. And it took me months to complete because I didn't just want to add anything. I wanted my decor to be meaningful. So, oh yeah, I got my loungewear on too, guys. So, excuse me. Oh, I have to show you guys too, my toilet tissue holder. It's like, um, I got these this from Lowe's and I got that from Amazon because Lowe's didn't have it anymore, but it's from the same brand, so. But yeah guys, that's my bathroom. Hey guys, so I hope you enjoy my half bathroom reveal that was literally a labor of love again it took me some time and I hope you enjoyed it let me know if you liked the bathroom um do you think it's um too girly because I'm like the only girl in my family I have three boys and a husband do you think it's perfect for a half bathroom? What I was going for was a vibe like when I had company, they would want to go in the bathroom and like vibe out with their selfies, right? Um, that's what I did. Like I want when I have company for people to come in and like, oh, this is a cool bathroom. Let me get a selfie here. Let me stand in front of the mirror. It's a cool picture behind me. Um, I was going for that vibe. Um, also, I just wanted something when I walked in the bathroom. I just felt like, oh. This is so cool. So, yeah, I'm not a um, I'm not like a proclaimed like decorator. I really like to do it. I'm just really slow at it because I take so long to like make up my mind. But when I actually make up my mind, I feel like it really comes together. So, yeah, like the bathroom was a labor of love. Now I'm actually working on my master bathroom which is taking longer than I expected because I have like where my tub is, I have such a big wall and I'm looking for a perfect, the perfect piece of art. So I know that's gonna take some time. And to be honest, Hubby and I are talking about selling our home or possibly selling our home or maybe even renting it out and moving. So with that said, I'm not sure if I wanna like go hard with decor um or just put you know pieces together 
that way if we get a buyer and they come in they're like oh this is really set up really cool so and they can have a vision of what they can do with it but anyway i hope you guys enjoyed um this brief little vlog i hope it's short um i'm gonna edit and hopefully i can get it down and um i'm just trying to get comfortable with the camera vlog style because we're moving around and um We're back, we're back. I had to cut, I had to cut. I got one sleeve up, one sleeve down. Let me pull my sleeves up. But yeah, do you guys like vlog style? Let me know. Do you like getting up close and personal with me? Do you like me being in another part of my home? Like, tell me, because what I'll do is I'll start to incorporate more uh, vlogs, um, just to give you a little bit about my family. I'm making this walk longer but anyway just to give you a little bit about my family my husband is very supportive he jumps in and jumps out every now and again um, he doesn't like to be on the camera but he will get on every now and again it depends on his mood um, he has a cool personality sometimes he's down to earth sometimes he hmm um, the kids they're really never uh, on a camera they'll come around every now and again so you may hear them in the background um, my youngest son plays video games so I know you guys hear the hear him in some of my other videos or whatever but um, yeah so just a little bit about Kira Kira loves fashion beauty natural hair you'll get a little bit of life, lifestyle and when uh, corona go away you'll get a little bit of travel so in the meantime, I'm signing off with my peace sign. You guys have a good day. If you like this vlog, please like, comment, share. And if you like the vibes, join the family, hit that subscribe button. We'll love to have you. Follow your girl on Instagram at Kara Jacka Rose. And have a good evening. Peace.